me again and in today's video i'm gonna install mac or sonoma 14.5 and we are not going to use our typical open core bootloader but i'm going to try and use the clover bootloader for this installation so i've already created the bootable usb i didn't see the meaning of it showing you because i've done a lot of video of how you can do that so without wasting much time so i'm gonna go to my phone and then we can continue the installation process so let's go okay guys so let's restart our machine and then let me show you first this is the monterey 12.6.3 so let's just restart and let me show you I've just plugged in my so it on F12 and then I'm going to select our USB and then there we go you can see we have our boot menu so and you can see our so what i'm going to do right now i'm gonna select our install from mac os or normal beta and then hit on enter there we go as you can see the bar down there let me just okay so as you can see right here we have our boot menu so what we need to do we need to head on to disk utility and then continue from there so here we need to format our ssd so I'm going to format this SSD right here. So I'm going to just erase this one. And I'm just going to leave it to Sonoma HD and then erase. Okay, so there it's done. So what we need to do right now is click on done. And then close this with security and then click on install macOS Sonoma beta and then continue. So again click on continue Let's wait for it to respond Okay let's agree to Apple terms and condition and then select our the the SSD that we have just formatted and then it on continue so the installation process will start and I'm going to pause the video and come back when it's done we are at 16 minutes remaining so it will restart anytime from now Let me just 15 minutes remaining so anytime from now the machine will restart and then we'll go to the next phase of the installation that is the 29 minutes remaining the drill is just the same actually i don't see any difference from all other the 
all the other in installation sorry so let's wait for it to finish and then we can proceed <clears throat> Actually, what I've seen in this fourteen point five beta, I've noticed that the installation took so much time, like the previous distro or mac os so that's one thing that i have noticed with this 14.5 beta so let's just wait and see if it will perform Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay guys, so in this phase, if everything goes well, we will be setting up our Sonoma. So let's wait and see if all goes to plan. But there we go, the bar is full and it has just restarted again. So that's it on F12 select your our USB and then we can can choose to install Mac OS so normal from Macintosh HD via preboot it on enter okay so that's a good sign guys There was a splash of the grays on our screen, so that's good news. Okay, another restart. But we don't see our SSD so let me just restart the machine again it on F12 and it on enter And there we go, you can see this is our mouse cursor right here. And boom. Let me just oh, continue with this. Okay guys, so as you can see we are greeted with our screen here. So let us continue. So we turn our country or region. next let me customize this one first just delete this one 
then continue 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 not now my computer does not continue data and privacy click on not now agree agree just put on your user and your password like so so let me just add this one and then continue <coughs> so it's creating our user account so let's wait for it to finish okay we are almost done with this oh, let's wait for it okay so continue and I don't want to use that so I'll just select my time zone I'm gonna set it up later and I'm going to disable Siri. Um, let's go with the duck. Like so. Okay. And then continue. Keyboard setup. And let me just see how this one will work out. Okay, so keep that one on done. And there we go, guys. We have successfully installed our Sonoma. So what I'm going to do next, I'm going to copy our EFY to the partition and then we'll fix the graphics. As you can see right here, we don't have the graphics acceleration. So if you go to about this mark, you can see we have the 14 MBs. So let me just go to the screen recorder and then we can continue this is our screencast and as you can see right here we have our sonoma sorry about that and you can see this is the intel hd 16 and then 1536 mbs and etc so if you come here you can see this is the intel duo core and let me just download the hacking tool so that i can show you and you can see right here you don't have the internet and let me show you right here what i'm using i have connected my i have connected my hacking torch with my mobile sorry it's hacking tool Okay, this is the Ben Becker one. I've connected my Wi-Fi here with my phone via USB tethering, and that one is included in the EFI folder that I'll share with you here. And I've used the on Onris Kex, the Onris. I don't know if that's the correct pronunciation, but yeah, this one enabled me to tether my Wi-Fi via Android device. So let me just download this one. And 
so that's it guys the video i've shown you how you can install the mac os sonoma beta 5 and sorry let me show you my bootloader here so that you can let's go to privacy go down here and then open anyway enter your password then open so as you can see this is our and if you come here to boot you can see our our bootloader is global version 51 56 and the latest version is 5158 so and everything is fine so i'll just upload the video i'll no i'll just upload the efy to the site and then you can just use it at your convenience so okay guys that is for this video hope you like it just leave a, subs a subscribe if you are not subscribed and I'll see you in the next one.